Turning now to softball, second year head coach Mike Spangaki's program is still in the rebuilding phase, and the season got off to a rough start as the Raptors dropped 12 of their first 14. But many of those losses were nail biters, and the team never dropped its head. The last third of the season, their play really improved, and they came into the regionals playing their best ball of the season. After knocking off the Owls from PG in the first round, they once again advanced to the regional finals, and for the second year in a row, they faced the Pioneers from Anne Arundel. The Raptors played well, but the Pioneers pulled out a 5-4 win to earn the trip to Nationals. Two years in a row, just one run kept the Raptors from advancing. But again, this program is still developing, and there was much to be proud of. Most importantly, despite all the hardships of weather, injuries, and transfers, this team never quit. They got inspirational efforts from several players, particularly Maria Sanchez, their only experienced pitcher. Sanchez started 21 games, won seven, and hurled an amazing 127 innings. She also led the team with a 460 batting average, 38 RBIs, and tied for the team lead in homers. Meanwhile, Morgan Howard hit a robust 424, and Olivia Howe, who shared the team lead in homers, hit 418. The team's hard work didn't go unnoticed when postseason honors were announced. Sanchez, Howe, Howard, and Madeline Niffenegger made all region first team. Sanchez, Howe, Niffenegger, and Gabby Pascasio made the regional tournament team, and Maria Sanchez was also named second team All-Maryland Juco. Sanchez and three others will return next year. So the work continues for Mike Smagaki, but with his work ethic and deep roots in Montgomery County High School softball, I have no doubt this program will continue to make strides and soon be making national championship appearances. Don't go anywhere because up next we'll take a look at the annual MC Athletics Banquet where the two biggest athletic awards of the year were handed out. You're watching The Raptor Report.